Welcome to YouTube Excel Magic Trick number 8. Hey, if you want to download this workbook, click on my channel and then go to my college website and you can download this YouTube workbook with 10 tricks. Hey, in this one, we want to see sometimes we get a column of data and we really want to separate and have first name or last name or whatever the, the items are in separate columns. So what we're going to do is first, before you do text to column, you make sure that there are blank columns next to you. We have two items separated by column, so I just need to make sure that there's one column. But if there was three items or four items separated by a space or a comma or a tab or something, then I have to make sure there was a number of columns. Now I want to highlight this whole column of data, and instead of using my mouse, I'm going to click in that first cell, and I'm going to control shift down arrow. Boom, that's highlights real quickly. You can do down arrow, left arrow, whatever you want. Now, text to column is in 2003, data menu, text to columns. Here in 2007, we click on the data ribbon, and there it is, text to columns. Boop. And it asks delimited. That means some character is separated in it. Fixed width is when there's a fixed width, like a number of points. Click next, because we have a character. And here's the whole key. You just got to tell it what kind of character. We have a comma here separating the pieces. So I click comma. I uncheck that. And it gives you a sample. Click finish. Oh, that is beautiful. Let's try this again over here. And it's a space this time. I'm going to click text to column. Oops, I'm going to. I'm going to hit Control Shift Down Arrow to practice, because that's good when you have a gigantic column of things. Text to columns, delimited, click Next. I'm going to click a space and get rid of that. Oh, and it gives me a preview. Finish. No way. That is Excel magic. All right, see you next YouTube magic trick.